Hi, Suzanne Phillips here, broadcasting live from Hoover Reservoir in beautiful, sunny Columbus, Ohio. This is my view today. I'm out of my kayak, and um, I was taking a break because this morning I was doing a uh, my volunteer call on a Vietnam Skype project. So I was just wanted to touch base and um, update you on that and see if you guys had any questions about the volunteer experience or if you had or if you had any questions about learning English as a second language what kind of tutoring um, what kind of venues would you like to see me do and uh, I want to talk about a couple terms just kind of random I had to explain to my student today what a kayak was hello and uh, I had a hard time without pulling up a picture so it was really difficult to explain a kayak without a picture so I was kind of curious as to how people learned and whether you thought it was easier to learn visually through a picture or explaining through words trying to define it. So I eventually pulled up a picture of my kayak that I had from the last time I was out. So it kind of inspired me to broadcast again live today. So one of the other terms I'll segue into was talking about going with the flow. So when she asked me about the kayak, I kind of had to go with the flow and figure out what she was how to work how to you know make it work for her how to make her understand so going with the flow is just kind of letting things lead you however you however it goes and seeing where it takes you like right now i'm just sitting here kind of drifting and i'm guessing you probably like this view better than me talking so i'll kind of pan around so you can see it um, it's a gorgeous day out here. So I'm just going with the flow out here this afternoon I'm really just sitting with my feet up in front of my kayak and just digging life So that's kind of going with the flow and the other one is losing your train of thought Which I seem to be doing a lot when I'm doing these scopes, but I keep practicing and trying so if you guys uh, Like it let me know if you'd love to see me from a reasonable location that I could do I would love to do it. So I'm um, losing my train of thought which I'm kind of doing right now. So Losing your train of thought just means you were thinking about something and she wanted to say and you got totally distracted. Me, probably by the traffic that's going by behind me and um, also by the just fantastic view that I have going on here today. And I'm finding it hard to just uh, leave and go back to my office and do some work. But so when you lose your train of thought, you just kind of, you had something in your mind and it's almost like you forgot you, what you were going to say. So it was. Uh, it's happened to me a couple times today, so it's something like distraction or just you just lose the thought of what you're saying. So I hope you guys enjoyed my short scope from uh, Hoover Reservoir today. I definitely have fun being out here and doing this. And um, if you like it or have any questions about conversational English, uh, check me out on my Twitter at um, Suzanne P67 or on my Facebook page, Suzanne Phillips, English as a Second Language. I hope you all have a great day. It's a beautiful day out here, and I hope you enjoyed my scenery out on Hoover Reservoir in Columbus, Ohio. Thank you guys for tuning in so much. Have a fantastic day.